Hey, hi guys, welcome to YouTube and welcome to C and C++ tutorials. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can create Eclipse and how it works basically, okay? And why we put these values and what is the meaning of these values for what we basically put these values, all this, all these things I wanna clear in this video, it's very easy. First, let me show you compile and run. And here you can see this is called Eclipse. It's loading right now. <laughs> and here you can see the result this is a eclipse now how we create it basically it's very easy to create the uh, uh, one thing i will tell you that eclipse is a combination of circle and the arc function that's it that's all okay you can make different kind of circles by using eclipse very easily like you can create egg shape circle or any different type of uh, circle now let me show you how here you can see it have six values so uh, i will explain you these six values and you will understand automatically the how eclipse function works so here you can see the first two values are 150 150 these two values belongs to a position of your eclipse so first is a x position and then next value is for a y position now let me draw this in uh, paint also this is a paint here, here you can see i have a 300 by 300 canvas and i have chosen x axis and y axis as 150 150 so this is a y axis here and from here this is a x axis also this is a center of this canvas now uh, there is uh, two other values 0 and 180 now these two values belongs to a starting angle and ending angle same like a arc okay so now what what do you mean by the starting angle and ending angle here you can see the two values 0 and 180 0 is a starting and 180 is a ending angle now let me explain you through the diagram or paint uh, you can uh, you uh, know that the circle is a 360 uh, shape okay it's a circle is a 360 shape so how a circle is formed it is from formed from 0 to 360 now suppose this is my center okay this let me choose the next, uh, other color this red is the center now the 0 is starting from this point 0 and now if i make the whole circle this is this will be 360 but suppose if i do something like this then this will be 0 to 180 so starting angle is a 0 ending angle is a 180 now this kind of shape will be made now suppose if i do something like this so this will be 0 from 0 to 90 and this type of arc will be created we will create this arc so you know this will be a new kind of uh, shape for you now let's create this here this will be like this 0 to 90 so you can see this first value is the starting angle and the second value is the ending angle now let me put uh, 90 instead of 180 and here i will write starting angle and ending angle that's it now we have two other values here these two are little different um, values uh, in, instead of a radius in case of circle and in case of arc we use radius but in case of eclipse we use two values okay these both values belong belongs to radius but uh, this first value belongs to x-axis and this second value belongs to a y-axis radius now uh, let me show you through the diagram here you can see this is a y-axis this line and this side is a x-axis now now uh, from this circle first value is uh, for the uh, x axis so from here from the center i will choose the radius of a x axis suppose i wanted to push this into here so i uh, you know to the edge of the canvas i will write 150 and now if i wanted to make and this will be now um, point here will be the point okay this is now our new point in green dot for the x 
and now I will give a second value which is for the y radius now for y radius we give this uh, vertically suppose I will just give this uh, like 10 like here okay this is a uh, y axis now now uh, angle is chosen uh, mm, uh, 0 to 90 and uh, or sorry the angle is already chosen now what will happen these two points will be connected like this and we will get this result now we will get something like this instead of this now so let's see if we got this or not let's just put these values here we i will write 10 and here will i write 150 let's see what we get let me write 150 here and execute and compile and here you can see we got the result something like this it, it's totally different uh, from what we have expected let's see why it's a different what we mm, done wrong okay so x is a 150 and y is a 10 and what values we have put in here 10 okay sorry we have put it uh, uh, 10 for the x and uh, 150 for the y uh, for x it was the 150 and for the y it was the 10 now let's once again compile and run and now there you can see we got the desired result okay so this is our result so this is it for this video thank you so much and if you wanted to make a circle you can make it easily just draw like so, sorry if you wanted to make a egg shape like this just make it just find out the uh, x radius and the y radius and uh, choose degree from 0 to 360 and you will get the this result it's very easy thank you so much bye take care if you have any question you can ask me in the comment sections bye take care